One of the things I really love about getting away and getting out in nature especially is being able to refocus on what I want. When I get out in nature, my mind quiets down and I usually feel a lot more peace and calm, which means that a lot of my anxiety and depression goes away and I just feel very at peace and at one with nature. It also helps me connect with my higher power. It helps me connect with my God and it helps me connect with myself a little bit better. Part of why I really appreciate this is it helps me be able to evaluate what is the most important thing to me, what I want to focus on, and if I'm really headed in the direction that I want to go. This is something that I have really learned about myself, um, that being in nature is super important for me personally, and it really is necessary for my mental and my physical health as well. When I come out in nature, my body pains usually go away. Um, things that I'm worrying about are reduced and I almost don't even think about them. And I just really feel like it's the getting back into nature is really what helps ground me in so many different ways. Now for you, this might be something different. It's really important to be able to find those things that help support your mental health, your physical health, so that when you are really driving towards a goal or driving towards a focus, you have that support for yourself so that you can keep going and doing the hard things that you have to do. One of the things that I like to do is push myself to do hard things in nature. And when I do that, it helps me find ways to overcome other hard things in life. When I was going to USU, uh, I was taking a math class. And one of the things that our instructor said was that when you work out math problems, it forces your brain to create new thinking uh, connections and neural paths in your brain. Now, I don't know how true this is. I'm not a scientist. I'm not a doctor. But I do know that when I do hard things, it does seem to create new possibilities and new solutions to problems. So go out there and figure out what yours are. One of the other things that I've really been doing while I've been out here today is focusing on the things that I'm grateful for. I love listening to the birds and hearing the wind and feeling it when the sun's beating down. I love listening to the water um, and other aspects of nature, sometimes even just the quiet. So when you have the chance today, each day, see if you can find out what really helps you to find that balance and connection with yourself and then find ways and times that you can take advantage of that for yourself. I would love to hear what those things are. For more content like this, you're welcome to join my Maximize Your Life Facebook page um, and I will see you again soon.